Ah, oh, that was a nice break. I think it, I should get back to the game. Yeah, at first I should probably check this very dirty sign. Mm, I think I can spare that. Rayquaza, can I play your game? Yes, I am. Yes, I would. I just said that. Yes. Yes again. Dang it. Pay attention, Rayquaza. Alright, how do you play this thing? Uh, I'm not holding a Wii Remote, so I just... I guess I'm gonna have to lean my body left and right or something. Oh, uh, Superman 64 on a ground level. Okay. Avoid zappy things. I gotta be careful of the edges. That shouldn't be too difficult. Okay. Let's see. Shooting two. This is by far the most complex one yet. Uh, Lucario, just because you seem pretty agile and you gave me a lot of trouble in the chase, so. I think it's only fair that I take over your body. <sighs> Go! Ah, oh, I was a little late there. Ooh, you control quite well, that is for sure. Oh, I should have went to the other web red one, but that is okay. Doing pretty well. Oh, geez. Uh, I wonder if I should be going for that blue one. I'm not sure. It probably is worth a lot more than the rest. Yeah, I should have went for that other blue one. My bad. Oh, geez. Oh! Oh, some of them are in the air, apparently. Uh, blue ones definitely must go for the blue ones. Ah, perspective! Killing me here. Ah! Haha! Switch positions! If I was holding a Wii Remote, but hey, oh. Yeah! Ha! Ha! I shoot the balloon Pokemon too? That would be kind of interesting. Well, guess not. I can't shoot any Pokemon in general. Aha! Ah! Wow, this. The aiming cursor is humongous. It literally is the entire cursor. Lucario is by far. One of the better choices. Oh shoot, did I just hit an X one? Yeah, maybe not when the X's are in play. Oh shoot, I'm reacting to the X's. No! Oh, I thought the bonus was 50,000 for whatever reason, but I got the bonus. So there's no need to worry. No need to panic. The attraction is cleared with the bonus. Rayquaza, you should be proud of me for this. Even though I was whacking every single target, including the ones with the X's on them. <laughs> Woo! Yup. Final prism piece! Collected with the power of friendship. This I will do. Okay. Woo! Mm, not right now, thank you. Alright, Shaman. Talk to me! I'm not going to talk to those flowers again, dang it. <laughs> Thanks! Why not? Uh, how do I get them to bloom? Huh. Flower lovers, huh? You there! Would you, uh... Do you have a hint of sorts? Why, yes I would. Watering can. Hmm. Well, thank you. Alright, let's water this flower. For once, I think I want to check it. Yes! Allergen suffers, beware. Yes! 
Oh. Well, we have a balloon. Okay. Ah. Good thing for that flower. Yeah! I'm so glad I don't have to go down to the meeting place. <laughs> Granted, it's one drift blim fly away, but still, it's kind of inconvenient. Yay! Oh, way to ruin a moment, loading screen. So, this is the Sky Pavilion, huh? It's gorgeous. Ah! It's Mew. Uh-oh. I got all the prism pieces here. Relax, falling thing. Why? Well, let's pop it back together. No, I friended most of them. Oh, I see. Indeed we should. Hmm. Hmm. Sneaky, sneaky. So there might be a little puzzle around here. Okay, you have fun. I'll work on this puzzle. Oh, this place looks pretty fun to explore. I'll take a run around the perimeter, I suppose. It's not too large of an area, so this won't take too long. And then there's just a central area of sorts. Ah, nice view. And back to the balloon. Okay, there's another... Slippery floor, dang it. Another ring around the rosy in the middle here. Chikorita, have you seen Mew? Oh. Oh, okay. I don't know if that's really going to be an issue in all honesty. Wait, was that Charmander over there? Yeah, it is. Hmm, something doesn't feel right about this. Hmm. Wah! Dang gaps. It's decaying ruins. Oh, wait, maybe I should have checked Piplup down by the balloon. Boy, wait, wait a second. I thought you were down by the balloon. Hmm. You're awfully suspicious, Piplop. Or maybe not. Hmm. Where's a hole that I can fall down, dang it? <laughs> ah. There's never a hole when you need it. There we go. Piplop? Are you also down by the balloon? Oh, okay, this is getting weird. Huh? Yeah, that's... Um... Hmm... I'm scared! Okay, where's that slope again? Dang maze-like structure. Ah! Must use double dash sometime. Yeah, like seriously, where? 
Am I that? Do I have that bad of a sense of direction? <laughs> I always knew it was bad, but I didn't know it was this bad. I mean, it's just two circles, isn't it? Wait a second. What if I went... Hmm. Eh. Mm. Dang this body. Still don't feel I have complete control over it. Ah, there we go. Must have missed the branch here. I am a doofus. A good thing no one was here to see that. Well, there's something suspicious about two Piplops here when I only came here with one. Ah, I knew it! Mew use transform. Oh, I see. So does that mean we can reform the prism? Woohoo! Okay, what's needed? Okay. Most epic skill game set in the game. Right here, right now. No, I just wanted to see what you guys had to say about this. Hmm, that's possible. All right, let's start. True, I guess that seems to be the uh, the way of the Poké Park. <laughs> Holy mother of pearl. Looks like some sort of pathway. First mini game. Obstacle hop. Redux. Go, 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 go. But carefully. And I mean carefully. Because the controls are oh, a little awkward for dowel poopers. A little awkward for jumping. This is by far the hardest obstacle hop in the game because of the controls, but it is indeed possible to do. Obviously, otherwise the game couldn't be completed. <laughs> Gotta watch the shadow. And there we go. Woo! Got more? Bring it on. Battle time! Okay, what you got? Charmander. Oh, dear lord! I guess we're about to find out. That's a lot more powerful of a Pokemon than you would expect. Especially since Transform only seems to work against Pokemon that are in the nearby area. Ah! Aha! Oh, jeez. <laughs> You will not defeat me! Yeah! Woo! You friended yet? Thanks! Uh, I guess... Nah, I guess not. Wow, you are definitely the most stubborn one to friend. <laughs> oh! Oh dear. Dragon ground type. Electricity. Useless. Uh oh, charge! Ah! Oh, you're not that bad. <laughs> I was expecting you would be a lot more ow pain, a lot more difficult. Nope. Oh, yep. I guess so. Oh, don't knock me off the edge. I'm the only one that can knock Pokemon off the edges. Got another? Bring it on! Oh, 
My Arceus. Well, I'm just hoping that you're slow enough to the point that I won't have any issues defeating your rock darkness. Wow. What the heck was that? <laughs> was that like Dark Pulse or something? I don't know, you're not doing a very good job. <laughs> Woo! Garchomp was your best form, that's for sure. Got anything else? Alright! Chase time! Go! Epic music! And, oh jeez, got caught on the edge. Oh wow, that was way too easy with an upgraded dash. <laughs> Normally those holes up ahead would get in the way, but I was able to catch Mew before that was even an issue. Sorry Mew, I'm just thinking to myself. Yeah! Oh, we're not best friends yet? That's kind of... I mean, I've played a lot of games with you. <laughs> you did? Well, you are a psychic type. You're welcome. There's still a couple more, though. Let's get that sky prism back together. What do you guys have to say about it? Uh, yeah. Hopefully, I should say. Alright, Mew. Let's do it! Let's use the magic of friendship! The power of the friendship says restored the castle. Oh, wait, what? Actually, these are more like ruins, in all honesty. <laughs> so that floating thing I seen was part of the sky prism? So what, do they just fit together like one of those 3D block puzzles? Hmm. Apparently so. Now will the earthquake stop? Will the rainbows return? Will the hearts reunite? We shall soon see. Woo! It's raining friendship! There's the rainbows. Triple rainbow all the way across the horizon. Wait, you thought I was going to say something else? Talking to the Pokemon not name in particular, of course. Who else would I be talking to? I mean, geez, that'd be crazy. Looking good all around, I guess. Still a couple Pokemon here and there to friend. But some can only be friended after uh, taking on Mew, so... It's kind of important, that what I did there. Although I do wonder if the friendships I gained were enough to get back to the real world. I guess I'll soon see. Gonna land back at the meeting place? Certainly would make a lot of sense since that's where the balloon was. Mm, yeah. No puff of smoke underneath the balloon when he landed? That's kind of weird. 
Was it that soft of a landing? Ah, so those are your fireworks. Yeah! Interesting. Um, yeah. Mm, what a way to ruin a moment. <sighs> oh, dang it! I'm still in the game! Well, something tells me I gotta friend the remaining regular Pokemon in order for me to get out of this place. Yep, that's exactly what I thought. Except maybe the password Pokemon. I need the internet to get the passwords. The game, I think that would be a little bit too... Uh, un not like unexpected. Too demanding for me to guess the passwords of special Pokemon later on. That does sound good. I mean, I don't, I guess I'm not in that much of a hurry to return to the real world. But, I mean, there's still more Pokemon to win over, I suppose. Wait, a new signboard? What? Where did a signboard come from? <clears throat> No, not right now. Alright, signboard. What, 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 who? No, you know what? Sure, what the heck? That sounds like fun, just for the, for the heck of it. And that would be Chatot. Hmm. Yeah, bro. Snorlax. If Snorlax was up there, the whole thing would be crashing down. <laughs> Last, that would be Tyranitar. In fact, his other two transformations were not on the list. Actually, I shouldn't say his or her, it's just Mew, because Mew is genderless. Oh, okay, okay. What does the sign say? Yep! That is indeed one of the passwords. This is for the US version of the game. The password is different depending on the version of the game that one has. So, yeah, that's something that I'll be uh, covering a little bit later, but you know what? Sure, why not? Just in case someone happens to be watching this. You know, if this actually is some sort of walkthrough, which I highly doubt it is. I mean, I'm trapped in the game after all. How am I supposed to record this? <laughs> anyway, these people made the game. I did not. But it was definitely fun to play through the game. And hopefully show off how to befriend all the Pokemon that I possibly can. It's still not totally complete at the moment, but... Yeah! That's... Something I'll have to finish later in order to get back to the real world, I suppose. Uh, just how things go in life. You just gotta befriend a lot of people, I guess. <laughs> I don't know where these pictures came from anyway. They're rather artistic. Like, they're definitely not concept images per se. But they're definitely artwork made for just the credits alone, but I've never seen anything like this per se in like games development periods and stuff like that. I've never seen anything except for I mean I've never seen artwork like this before the game was released. That could be wrong though, and maybe there's a couple of slides here and there. Because usually the uh, designers like to put stuff in credits. That were like beta stuff to just to show off or whatnot. Then again, this wouldn't be like game screen caps or anything like that, obviously, because the game would be rather ultra minimalistic. <laughs> but uh, 
Yeah, I'm just thinking out loud here. It's kind of nice that they made these just for the credits, in all honesty, because usually the credits just have some... Um, well, I, I wouldn't I wouldn't say, like, uh, usually. It's, it's like a black screen with white text across it. It's a common theme for credits. Though sometimes they throw in cutscenes or, well, special stuff like this. Looks like there's a I'm on a movie set there, but I know it's not. It just looks like that I'm on a movie set there of sorts. Just the way there is stuff set around there, I don't know. Just gave off that feeling. There's actually the uh, lava zone. That looks like the pathway to uh, Blaziken, possibly. Maybe. Although, maybe it's not. It's kind of... Blaziken didn't have like a zigzag part. Speaking of Blaziken, I still gotta get the bonus from his uh, minigame. And come to think of it, I don't think I friended him either, so I guess I'm gonna have to, to go over there anyway. So that's gonna work out. Just go over there, friend them, get the bonus off of his boulder bash. Sounds like a day? <clears throat> Sounds like a fun day, I mean. At first, I at that uh, name that just scrolled off screen. I thought that said Seth MacFarlane at first. I was gonna be like, what? I don't think he was in this game. Didn't he voice acting or anything in this game in general? <laughs> I, I did like a double tape there. Ah, yes, Game Freak. The Pokemon producers. Been around for a long time. Can never forget about Game Freak. Man, after these credits, I think I'm gonna take a nap before I friend the rest of the Pokemon without passwords and stuff like that. I am beat. There's a mini game marathon. This is definitely from the Sky Pavilion. Ah, uh, Satoru Iwata. Can't forget about him either. Very important guy in Nintendo. And again, all these people are important to all the games, because you know, all the games can be made without a team of people and whatnot. It's a team effort, basically. Ah! Why? <sighs> Alright, I'm taking a break. Right here, right now. 